What's up Geeksters, it's me Omar from Geekster Labs and today guys I got a really cool product that was sent to me free for review from AnthroDesk and this is basically their stand-up dual motor desk kit. And so this thing retails for a little under $400. I'll have a link down below if you guys are interested in checking it out and purchasing one for yourself. But the really cool thing about this is that you know, unlike most stand-up desks that actually come with a tabletop already, this one is basically a kit. So it's just the base and the bottom legs for the stand-up desk with the motor built in. So this allows you to take whatever desktop that you want to use to match your office setup, your desk setup, or however you want that desk setup to be. You can get whatever tabletop you want and you'll, you can actually use it with this kit, which is pretty cool because a lot of stand-up desks don't have the sexiest, coolest countertops or tops on them at all. So if you want to get something like a cool piece of reclaimed wood or even have a metal desk, or whatever it is that you want to use, you can use that with this kit to be able to make a custom stand-up desk. So this supposedly is the newer version, which is easier to set up and should be able to set up much quickly. So let's see how long it takes me to put this whole thing together. Boom, there you go, all done. And that basically took me 20 minutes, so that was super fast. Uh, on the website it says it should take 15 minutes. So in my defense, I did pull my back about two weeks ago, three weeks ago, so I move a little bit slower right now, and this thing is pretty heavy duty. So it took me about 20 minutes to put together, but it mostly comes fully assembled. You basically just attach the top part and then the legs back onto it and then tighten up the, uh, the way the, the legs kick out. And that's pretty much it. So now we have the base section right here it is fully assembled and ready to go. It is carrying my weight. I do weigh 250 pounds, so this is able to hold up to 265 and it's having no issue lifting me up and down. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna be grabbing a tabletop and fixing it to this desk and then I'll give you some close-up shots on what it looks like when the table is actually installed. And just so you know, it does come with the screws that you use to bolt the tabletop to it. And it actually has some like rubber uh, little gasket bumper pieces here that uh, do a good job of holding the table but not scratching the bottom section of it when it is uh, attached to here. But it has all the screws needed to do that. That is something I just want to mention about that. So let's go ahead and grab the tabletop and I'll pop it onto here and then we'll give you some close-up shots of this. All right guys, so we're back and I have a tabletop on the desk itself. So I went with a uh, dry erase board type of tabletop. So I actually write notes and things like that all completely on anywhere on the desk itself. This actually came off of a desk that was also a stand-up desk, but it was a crank desk. It wasn't like actually a powered one. So I swapped it out and upgraded my legs here. So now we have a powered desk so I don't have to sit there and crank it to go from top to bottom. As you can see here, we have the control panel. It's been at uh, attached to there as well. Everything was really easy and simple to install. I basically put this upside down, put the legs on top of it, and with the included screws, just screwed them in wherever their, their openings were to hold it to the table. And that was pretty much it. I flipped it back over. This came with screws as well to hold that into place. And so here's where we have the control panel with the touch display. So I, now I have the, the thing so I can actually control it and set it to whatever height I want to set it to and, and make sure it memorizes that setting. So you just basically put your finger and touch it and that's where basically it goes to it. So I have the lower setting and I have the top setting. And so this thing actually goes really high up. Um, I've used stand-up desks before that didn't quite satisfy me to go in high up enough, but this one, I'm six foot two, and I like it to where I can sit at my desk and have my, my arms pretty much be at right angles while I'm using my laptop, my computer, whatever it is I'm, I'm using on the desktop. And this thing goes up actually higher than this. So the height adjustments on this is perfect. One of the things I really like about the buttons though is the fact that they're like almost capacitive. So like you have to, it, it doesn't work if you use like a pen or something like that to touch those buttons. It actually needs to have your fingertip on there to, I don't know, that static electricity type of thing. So what's good about that is if you accidentally bump into it, it won't just go up and down by itself, which is pretty nice because I've had that happen to me with desks before. But the fact that the, this thing is actually adjustable, I'm not sure if you can tell, but this is actually wider than initially when I showed it to you when I, when I put it together. I had to, it was about probably about right here and I had to spread the leg out to be a little bit further, further so it could be the full width of this desk. This is a 60 inch desk, 60 inches wide. So I tightened that back up and it's working pretty good. So like I obviously have the gray legs here, it goes well nice with the white top. And I basically have now a custom stand-up desk. And so you can apply whatever desktops or tabletops you want to this. If you want to go to Ikea or whatever and buy you a $50 cool tabletop or even have a custom painted one. Um, there's, I've really noticed with stand-up desks, you're kind of limited to what you can really get. And so if you want like a really awesome, just bright red type of table for like your gaming setup, whatever it is, you can totally use this kit and put whatever you want on top of it. Or if you want to use a metal top or even a glass top, I suppose you could put it on there as well. But very cool product. I really recommend you guys checking it out if you're looking for something a little bit more custom than what's currently available out there for you for stand-up desks to be able to do, have your own custom setup and have your own tabletop. So I'll put a link down below, like I said, in the description to make that really easy for you guys to find. And that's gonna be it for this review. If you have any questions about this product, post them down below in the comment section. I'll get back to you guys as quickly as possible. If you wanna check out some of my other videos, I got two of the clips here you can click on. 
And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on my face. And don't forget to ring that bell to be notified of all my new reviews as they get dropped on my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video review.